thank you diabetes india organizers for giving me an opportunity to speak on this uh, thank you chairperson kind in topic is low caloric sweetness so how much sweet is sweet? I have no conflict of except that on a lighter note i visited zaidas stall and had their sweets but not the salt so go ahead with that the uh, type 2 diabetes is get alarm consumption of low caloric sweetness and diabetic food is why this is up because quite compensate the palatable caloric intake so what are low caloric sweetness they are all similar names are also there artificial on nutrient they are defined as a higher degree as compared to the caloric sweetness we traditional the nns in small quantity for or or nil are not met up diabetic foods are generally nns in place. they are marketed targeting for low caloric caloric artificial sacrin attempt the direct are sweeter than at times time and table uh, sorry for the call there it give it daily take an it daily that's why that uh, toxic side effect are seen they are generally added as so as is sulfame and uh, patem has been well used it's due as is sulfame is well then home food it has a them but not very good and yeah which is effect of lose it we don't know what food are in there association appetite and then beverages with by nns take as come might cause us the very crisp and energy and some trials have also reduction in cut and nns also has beneficial i have shown contrasting results trials nns are fermented in what fermented help what are these trials a certain all scale an artificial as a low can be a dining food planning and lifestyle for pet obesity and glycemic in the energy uh, their diet structured weight loss well nutrient trial show there was benefit in is in any contrast fish it and there was in artificial found to have an there are certain put really have our i artificial um
they are artificial factories hard to advocate that they are good when technically they are when what are the downsides of you point of really naturally when we consume too much of artificial can taste by time as sweet our body and mind get used to the hype this may change the way we taste another nature it is not taste as sweet as sweetness this means cakes donuts and other extra we need to the side effects of this study show micro energy consumption and overall weight gain and uh, this trial which was done in india in a agra agrawal they included artificial adox then of insulin yes which taken for glucose artificial taken that can lead the insulin resistance higher insulin resistance in pain as as compared uh, not taking these artificial that may be because of the set in hormones the artificial this can trick them set in hormones per major i homa ir effect of on controlling can in option and blood glucose can release which can lead to deleterious impact on glycemic control and highlight the integrated postprandial glycemic is that it or there is more to it there are certain myths that these are anti obesity however they are not and they are not pharmaceutical provide us with cannot be used diabetes they can not reduce body weight without dietary and lifestyle modification and products in uh, without dietary restriction and not help and reduction in body weight can be affected energy deficit can be a reduction in so there are certain trials which show that it can result in infertility if it depends on the doses particularly and long term data is lack at present the us fda has approved them for generally safe to be and acceptable daily intake can be defined as amount of nns mg per kg body weight however usually adi is 100 times lower as i said it's also then the sweetener dose all uh, academy have approved has been and uh, with uh, restricted use uh, causes energy uptake are not counseled regarding deficit those patient then the weight gain can so there were various meta analysis with in diabetes Uh, sorry uh, dama and journal like uh, diabetes care and it has shown that it may reduce cardio metabolic rate certain extent if the diet is from pattern is uh, properly followed so i may go artificial sweeteners are low caloric sugar substitute that are found in many products they are cautious strong consumption and it has said that it is not healthy choice but it is less unhealthy it has been endorsed by ada artificial long time and they have been in use for control of obesity diabetes with diet and exercise while they may reduce the caloric intake per se they may not have any beneficial effect on control of diabetes in addition they may have other safety concerns uh, proven in longer trials or uh, Randomized control. So moderation is the key. Much of any 